Zerk's Technical Community College Board of Trustees unanimously approved the across-the-board tuition increase. Depending on what classes you're taking and where you're from, the increase per credit hour ranges from three to seven dollars more. If you're a student taking 15 credit hours per semester, uh, this increase is going to cost you ninety dollars uh, over the course of the year. The tuition increase will generate about a million dollars in new revenue, which school leaders say is much needed. We are the lowest funded community college in the state we have the lowest tax levies. And we do have increased costs because there is inflation just in supplies. There is some inflation in wages and we want to remain competitive and getting the best employees that we can. But of course inflation is something that the students have to deal with too. I feel like this is going to affect me a lot because not only is the college tuition going up but the food here is probably going to go up and sometimes I have to look at my mom and be like hey can I borrow 20 bucks this week because I can't pay for the food. I don't like that it's going up, but I understand why it has to go up. Anna Brindle and Stephanie Cruz are finishing up their second year at OTC, where they saw a tuition hike of about $3 last year. And over the last 10 years, tuition has gone up about $36. I like that it goes up a little bit in the time because it gives me time to prepare or I pick up extra work hours out during the summer. I do work two jobs to be able to like afford, you know, my car payments, my student payments, everything that goes into play with that um, but being here at OTC it has been pretty affordable for me and part of that is because both Stephanie and Anna receive money from the merit-based a plus scholarship program I would have not been able to go to school if it wasn't for the Pell Grant. Sixty percent of our students receive some kind of financial aid that does not include loans so we would encourage every student to fill out the free application for federal student aid or the FAFSA and the priority deadline for that in Missouri is April 1st so we really want everybody to get that done access that financial aid, and that will make help make college more affordable. Reporting for KY3, I'm Joe Hickman.